Tonight, students on the Goucher College campus have some answers after a classmate is accused of racially charged graffiti on campus. WMAR 2 News' Eddie Kadem has more on who was arrested and how students are reacting. Finn Arthur, the 21-year-old accused of spreading hate through racist graffiti on the Goucher campus, was arrested. Justin Pellis is one of the people that first reported the swastika and threats toward black students in his building. In regards to like hatred like this, it's not something you think about when you wake up in the morning. It's not something you think you're going to have to deal with the next day when you go to sleep. Police say Arthur was interviewed after it happened the first time. Then yesterday, more graffiti was found. Arthur was arrested on campus for both crimes. He was friends with students of color. The person themselves was a person of color mixed um, and like people are shocked. Ridwan Lau wasn't surprised that this happened. I wasn't really in a state of, oh no, this would never happen here. Um, I was more like, what are we going to do about it? They planned a blackout protest, bringing the school community together to move forward. I think it's really empowering when we have conversations like this because some people, don't, one, don't have the opportunity or the space to talk about it in this manner. Shifting forward and hoping that Arthur learns from his mistakes. The main thing I would be worried about is if he's had the right people to talk to. Mm -hmm. If there's been that support for him from the beginning, how would things change? On the Goucher campus, Eddie Kadem, WMAR 2 News. Now, Arthur was released following a bail review this morning. Now, the case is going to be forwarded now to the state's attorney's office for Baltimore County and they'll decide whether a further review to decide if this case meets the criteria for prosecution as a hate-related crime.